Hi guys, good afternoon. Now, this is a late check-in with you guys, but I'm in Saman still. I'm about to go back over to Angola, but I wanted to just do a quick browse on Front Street. Yeah, I just wanted to take a quick browse on Front Street. Um, you know, walk into the stores because I didn't get a chance because I came. And then, you know, um, yeah, everything was a rush and a party and a plan and a dinner and a drink and all that jazz. So now I want to just take a quick browse Front Street, show you guys a bit of the shopping in St. Martin because this used to be my vibe, you know? So I'm going to be going in here. So to this um, shade store, what's the shade? Pelican, like I said to you guys. I'm a shade lover, you guys. I love sunglasses. That's okay. I love me some sunglasses. I'm gonna go into the shade. So we're gonna take a browse along Front Street. Oh, just a bit of context. So basically, again, Simone is divided into French and Dutch. Part French, part Dutch. Okay. Part French, part Dutch. I am on Phyllis Ward, the Dutch side, the capital, the Front Street, the shopping area where you got the Front Street and the Back Street. So you have one road, which is the Front Street, where the tourist area where the cruise ships come in so you got the front seat with all the jewelry stores and all the high-end stores and you have back street where you have the more like clothing stores local vibes and stuff like that but of course still tourist friendly so i'm going to take you guys through st martin front street and back street just so you can see a bit of the vibe here in st martin so let's go Ooh, and of course don't forget to subscribe if you guys have not yet subscribed Jenny, to my channel Jenny. okay <laughs> oh my goodness one thing i love about st martin is the sunglasses Ooh, these are really nice but Tom Martin has really nice sunglasses like bomb bomb sunnies like I've traveled a few places and I feel like Tom Martin has like the best sunglasses I've ever seen honestly so like if you guys ever come to Tom Martin you need to check out the sunglasses I'm so annoyed like ugh. love these babies right here me and Ooh. see I haven't even tried on anything Okay, so these here, so these are nice. They're extra, extra, but they're not giving me extra, extra when I put them on. I like transparent lens, are the lens that kind of like, um, I, I like transparent lens. I like the lens that have like a gradient. I find they give off like a really nice bone. Jerry, when I got what you put on for my face. Oh, I Thank you. Sorry. <laughs> Don't worry, JV, I soon got out your hair. Oh, I think I have a pair of these and the black, but these look a little smaller. Yeah, these are smaller version. I have the bigger ones. I love big sunglasses, but I find myself reaching for like the smaller ones most of the time. Oh, these are nice. Because I guess. Ooh, bomb. Ooh. Sunnies. Sunnies. I love me some sunnies. I like stuff like this. this is Dolce. I feel Dolce and Gabbana. Is it Dolce? Are these Dolce's? Are these Dolce as well? I find Dolce is so my vibe. I don't know, something about Dolce's. Okay, these aren't really a vibe vibe, but they're a vibe, so to speak. I really love me some Dolce's. Ooh, these are the kind of stuff that I would like go to a store, shade store, and pick up at try on. Cause why not? Look at that shit. This bomb. Like this is me. Oh. I find something I really, really like. These are Marc Jacobs. Not bad. The price on these aren't that bad either. Where did I take them from? Cam? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I do like. You know what? These have always been a very popular shade. I think they're Prada's. Are they? Yeah, products have this design here. Oh, I think I can rock these though. This is a vibe actually. Definitely a vibe. So to speak. No, not bad. I feel like a vibe vibe. 
like a really nice vibe to be honest. <laughs> That's some nice ones. Okay. Ooh. Carreras. I don't have I've never really tried these, but these are not bad. Oh these are nice. These are bomb that gum. I love sunnies. Oh god, Samantha is a perfect place to buy sun sunglasses. I need to get myself a pair before I go back up. I think I will. It's just I'm such an indecisive person. Even my sunglasses, you guys, I bought my sunglasses online. Well, of course, I usually, like I said to you guys in my previous vlog, I usually shop in the, in the airport when I'm traveling because they have like the best sunnies. But yeah, I didn't get a chance to this time, unfortunately. But so far, I think these are my vibes, so to speak. I don't know, I'm trying them back on. It's nice. Try these ones on. Uh -huh. I really like them. Sweet. I like them. Carreras is a fucking vibe. The Carreras is a vibe. And the Prada's what a vibe. I didn't try this one. It's the colors too. No, it's the other color. These are a vibe. Yeah, these are actually. I'm going to go for I'm gonna like consider Is that bomb? Okay, so I just came out of Pelican Ugh. So I just came out of Pelican Shades. Pelican Shades have some really nice vibes. I'm gonna take a stroll up here. So you know what? One thing I also love about some mountain is the jewelry. The jewelry is bomb. Dot com. The jewelry is usually nice so in martin has really good jewelry this is the place to shop for like really really nice jewelry i'm not going inside because i'm not quite sure they want me to be videotaping their jewelry and inside so i'll just take a quick vlog but yeah i love some martin gold okay shall we head up the road oh i didn't know some martin got van cleef and Arpels, you guys this is nice Ah, bomb shit. Okay, so over here, like I said to you guys, the jewelry is really good. But anyhow, we are going up the road further. Oh, look at this. I love this. Oh my. The jewelry in St. Martin is everything. I love this necklace here. Oh, I want to see where it is. So I actually want to have a look of the perfume selections availability in St. Martin. I don't know what fragrances are you know how up to the time they are when it comes to scents so i want to have a quick browse so i have my friend's son with me and her brother <laughs> they're showing me around because my friend is gone she gone to walk and i'm here with her mom penha duty free oh stop it so i'm here at the penha duty free shop in st martin i'm just checking out the availability of fragrances oh my lord Good afternoon, hello. Oh, thank you. Ooh. Sanitize. So they actually have a duty free shop in the heart of the front street. Hello. This is everything. And just to show you guys the prices, so this is 138 US dollars. And this looks like the 100 mil. I can't see. Right, so this is the 100 mil, so in St. Martin. The C Passione, this look at Intense. The C Passione Intense is for 128 US dollars. I can't remember how much it is in England, but by the time I'm putting up this video, I will have a price comparison for you guys. And in England, C Fiori is discontinued, but it's actually available here. I love that. 121 US, the price aren't bad. You know what? I actually don't have this fragrance in my collection. And it just dawned at me that it would be cheaper to buy them here than in England because 121, actually no, not really. 121 US would be roughly around 110, 115, yeah, about 110 US, I mean 110 pounds. 
110 pounds so it's not really like a big difference it's more or less the same price so that's not so bad you know i have what i have i have this fragrance right i have that one i had that one give that one away they don't appear to have the newer version of the flower balm they do have the my way how much are they they do have they have the original my way oh sorry they have, what is it? they have the original my way oh they have the my way intense as well how much do they have them for how much oh so they have the original my way for 112 thank you very much how much you sell it in 10 for nice the intense i think is 123 123 yeah. yeah 123 okay so over here they have the original my way for 112 and the intense for 123 us not bad not bad obviously i'm gonna do a price comparison for you guys so you can have a look Ooh. So that duty free shop pretty much got everything just like in England, the same vibe. Oh, the same vibe, alien. They got alien goddess. I still have yet to get this fragrance in my collection. I really want to get it. So this looks like the the 60 mil for $80. That's not bad. Because I think that in England you could get the 80 mil for about 67 or 70 pounds there about. Not bad. Hello, is this Angel Muse? They got Angel Muse on the shelf still. Hello? But this is a, probably an older one because there's no more others. There's no other stock of it. So we'll just have it on display. Ooh, of course, Angel, which I don't really care for. OMG. Hello, I actually have never ever smelled this perfume. So now is where I put the phone down and actually smell. Okay. I've actually never smelled this perfume before, La Petite Robe Noir. And that's for 74. This is the 100 ml. She gotta go. So we gotta go now, right? Oh my god, that's actually really nice. Oh my night. Oh my goodness. Okay. So that's oh they got any sap. Is she coming back? Oh perfect. Okay, right. So basically I need to catch my boat to go back to Anguilla. So I'm giving you guys a quick browse. They got mangalen. Oh, I've never smelled this one either. Hello. Ooh. Sorry. I can't help it. I like to be in front. No, I do it. <laughs> I've never smelled um, mangalen bloom of rose. Oh wow, this is really pretty. Really, really pretty, you guys. Price. Let me just see the price of this one right quick. How much is that one? 125 for the 100 ml of the mangalen bloom of rose. Which one is this? The original? Yeah. Mangalen. Look, the, li the liquid looks different. And which one is this one here? The new one. Ooh, sparkling bouquet. I need to smell this. Okay, the sparkling bouquet is really pretty. It is really pretty, you guys. I've never actually smelled that one, but that is really nice. Okay, um. So obviously in England we don't have these on shelf anywhere. I have never ever been able to smell these in store. Should I smell them all? So this smells like a fresh cherry blossom, literally like a fresh airy cherry blossom fragrance. So Granada Salvia is like a champagne, citrusy, fruity, kind of like rosy one. A little bit of rose vibe. I'm not quite sure what I'm picking up in it, but it's more like a champagne spritzy vibe. So this one has like a fresh citrusy green vibe. It smells like, um, it has like lemons, but it smells like um, the one that I have coconut fizz it smells like coconut fizz with extra lemon in it orange soleil let's have a look at you okay so orange soleil it smells aromatic and it smells like a very strong dosa neroli mixing with the orange that's what that smell like it's quite nice yeah, actually peaches. it's peaches you get the peaches <laughs> and then you get no peaches in there oh my god okay so Dolce Gabbana like blue sun of, of course I have that if you guys follow me you know I love the entire Dolce & Gabbana line they don't have that they don't have the rest, the flankers, but I have that one. Narciso, I'm not a big fan. I have that one, of course. 
Elisab is bomb. Love, love, love Elisab. Ooh. All right, you guys, I'm really impressed with the selection of fragrances in Saint Martin. It's nice, they got a nice few hot selections. They have like the male and the female versions mixed together, but really nice nonetheless. I love that. Of course, my Versace Pour Femme. Love. Woo, tell me you got a flow. Okay, so they got my, oh my God. Look at it. Oh my God. Gold Fantasy, is this new? This is perfect. Oh my god. I never know y'all had this. Is you sure? No, this is just gold. I don't know this one. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to come back over to some What time is it? What time do you have? I don't want to. Oh my god. Hello? Did you guys know we had this? I didn't know that. Um. I don't know if I had this. Gold fantasy. Say it in the comments. Gold <laughs> fantasy. How much is it? Oh my god. Is this new? I don't know this perfume unless it's the older one. Could you imagine they actually have this Valentino fragrance? It's discontinued and they have it available in Saint Martin. Boom. Blueberry. Bomb. 114. 114. Thank you. Wow. Oh my god. I'm gonna really have to come back over here so, and take my time because the selection of fragrances in Samana is not fucking planned. Okay? I see y'all. This is a very popular male fragrance. I love this. I need to smell it because. Oh, this is nice. This is really nice. We gotta go now. Okay, we gotta go. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh my god, you guys, I had to run because I'm trying to rush to go over. I'm so sorry. But basically, this is the duty free shop in Front Street, Saint Martin. Oh, this is bomb. Thank you.